We have the WWE Women's Championship match as the champion EO Sky of Damage Control takes on the 2024 Women's Royal Rumble winner, Bailey. Former stable mates, we saw Bailey win the Royal Rumble. Well deserved. She's getting her flowers. She's getting her WrestleMania moment. She's going to have a chance to win the big one on the grandest stage of them all. EO has had the title since SummerSlam. Hasn't really been a memorable run. Don't really many, remember many people she's faced. Bianca Belair. I know she was in that triple threat, I think, with Charlotte. But she's a former Miss Money in the Bank. Damage Control now has Kyrie Sane with Asuka and Dakota Kai. They're going to have a six-woman tag match. Obviously, Bailey's going to win here. I don't think there's anybody in the world who's picking against Bailey. She's loved by the fans. She can play a great heel, but she's just as good as a baby face. She's a face yet again. I don't know if we'll get a return of the hugger gimmick. We don't need that or any of the old music she used to have, but there are rumors that maybe she may have a special performance with her entrance at WrestleMania, maybe Paramore or someone along those lines to sing her to the ring. She deserves it. She's fantastic in the ring. She's a great promo. She's a great character. And She's done a lot for the business along with the other horsewomen. And she deserves her flowers, and I'm glad she's going to get her moment at Mania, especially coming back from injury a few years ago and really putting damage control together, really pitching that idea, getting that pushed, getting them some sort of noticeable aspect with the fans, with Kyrie, with Asuka, and with EO when she came to the main roster. So I love me some Bailey. And I think Bailey's going to be your new women's champion. Now, what does that lead to on SmackDown? Bailey leading the division. We got Tiffany Stratton. We got Charlotte Flair, who will be back. We got Bianca Belair. We got Naomi. We got, I'm missing someone, but they have Jay Cargo now. Excuse me, Dakota Kai even. They have a lot of feuds for her to take this title, I think, through the rest of 2024, at least through the major PLEs. And let's see what they do with it. Uh, I think she's a good woman to have. Last time she had a record-breaking title reign, she did a fantastic job with it, and she turned here initially. Now she's going to win it again. And I think the sky is the limit for her with this title. Give her some meaningful stories, and I think they will put on a good match. EO is great in the ring, and I think Bailey will get the win and be your new SmackDown Women's Champion. Now make sure you guys join us for night one and night two, as we'll be live for Smack. It's not SmackDown. For WrestleMania Night 1 and Night 2 after SmackDown. And we will be talking about each and every match with you live. Breaking it all down. Giving you our predictions. And giving you any type of surprises or live reactions that you're looking for. As we get ready for the biggest night in wrestling of the year. The granddaddy of them all. WrestleMania. But yes, we'll be live for both nights. Night 1 and Night 2. Make sure you guys super kick that subscribe button. Like a bomb that like button. Backdrop that bell. Give me your predictions down below. Who wins? Does Bailey get her moment at WrestleMania? I think so. Stay tuned for more here on the Flex Zone Podcast.